inside this high-rise building in a Lagos central business district, a near quiet event is ongoing to celebrate one of Africa's best, an entrepreneur and philanthropist, Mr. Anthony Oyemechi Elumelu, at 60. Here gathered are close family members and those in the inner circle of his family business conglomerates. There are also members of another family that is so dear to Mr. Elumelu's heart, the Tony Elumelu Foundation Entrepreneurs. Exactly. <laughs> they are a group of young Africans with great ideas in different spheres, getting the support of Elumelu, who in 2015 committed $100 million to the foundation to empower 10,000 of them over 10 years. The reason we are gathered here today is to fulfill the first promise to invest 100 million US dollars to identify, train, mentor, and seed 10,000 entrepreneurs in 10 years. I'm from Ghana, Zimbabwe, Nigeria, Sudan, Rwanda, Rwanda. As a man who started out and climbed up quite early, Elumelu is eager to create more of entrepreneurs like him to spread wealth across the 54 African countries where his foundation is active. There are no drums or gong to mark his diamond jubilee, but there are words plenty and deep enough to show that heroes are celebrated in different ways. For your sake, Africa can beat her chest to say, I have raised the legendary son of the sun a fortune maker who dedicates his life to raising fortune makers and a pedestal on which the Africa of our dreams can stand. The young Africans have also started creating wealth in fulfillment of Elumelu's vision to stamp out poverty from Africa as shared by some of them. After training from the Tony Elumelu Foundation with the 5,000 seed capital received in 2021, Papa, today we produce over 12,000 pieces of eggs <laughs> weekly. We have employed six full-time staff and we pay them every month. Before I got into TEF, I was a local businesswoman. I was producing from home locally and manually. After TEF, I became corporate. We got a structure and we got a production machine. We are, not we are no longer producing manually, but we have a production machine. And from that, you have given me a platform. I was opportune, to, and my company was opportune to be present at the Intra-African Trade Fair in South Africa, thanks to the Tony Elumelu Foundation. After receiving a training which helped to uh, learn how to manage, negotiate, to hire, so I bring uh, some staff. We have uh, uh, those who are responsible for marketing, and uh, customer liaison. And because of that, we had our first client, which was uh, Dangote Cement Cameroon. Then later on, uh, a lot of uh, multinational followed up. So we helping them to uh, manage their, uh, the impact their businesses post on the, the environment. Happy birthday, thank you, sir. You are making impact in Africa on behalf of uh, Menina Farmers, the board of director, and the staff, I want to extend happy birthday, blessed birthdays to you. Thank you. I was the youngest recipient of the award because of our contribution to youth empowerment in Nigeria. Um, also, we have, thanks to the training and you know the funding we received, we have expanded our um, service reach to countries outside Nigeria, to Ghana, to the United Kingdom, to the United States. Even though you're here thanking him, I want to thank you all because your being here is something that makes him very happy. What you're all achieving, something that makes him very proud, fills him with so much hope for the countries you all come from, for the continent as a whole. Over 15,847 young African entrepreneurs have been funded through the TEF programs and market linkages provided for over 1 million through the foundation's digital networking platform, TEV Connect. Yet, Mr. Ilumelu is not about slowing down on his passion of giving wings to more young Africans to fly to the peak and achieve their dreams and, in the process, spreading more wealth across the African continent and strengthening the story of Africa that is rising. Dokubo Oyetunji.
Arise News, Lagos.